So it says Martin Chmelík, research engineer at TT Tech. I'm working in a, in a research group in TT Tech and in our team we're building the very first versions of potential future products. So this, this means we're, we're doing research in the area of scheduling, real-time control and computation and applying these into very first early versions of potential products. Yeah, I think that computer science or, or the world around us is changing so quickly nowadays, so it doesn't make too much sense to, to plan a long-term future. And I think for computer scientists nowadays, the, the challenges and opportunities are, are everywhere. So one doesn't need to worry too much about the long-term future and more to focus on, on, on the current state and be happy with the work you're currently doing. Right, so, so I did my master's at Masaryk University in Brno. I went for an Erasmus in, in, in Denmark, the University of Oslo, and then actually joined IST as, for, for my PhD. I think a, a very important one. So, so I think that there's some truth to this saying that you kind of become the average of the five people you work most with. So, so, so in that sense, you should surround yourself with very smart and hardworking people. And I think IST was exactly the right place for me in that sense. So, so I, I think it played a very important role in my life. Right. So, I think the first one would be to, to enjoy your time at IST and kind of use all the everything that IST is offering for us. So, so I, I think it's an excellent environment and, and, and a current student should really use everything IST has to offer. So that would be the first one. The second one would be probably to, to travel to conferences, to join workshops, to organize events, talk to people, share ideas, get, get new insights, kind of like be known in the community. And the third one is probably like a more general one is to, to ask questions because it seems to me that like at the moment when you decide not to ask a question because you're afraid it's not a smart enough question, then it actually accumulates. So, so I think from the very first moment you should ask all the questions that are interesting to you. So this, this should probably be something like defending the PhD thesis or something like that. But, but, but uh, I think for me, like, as it was maybe the, the table soccer tournament that, that happened annually. So I was uh, taking, uh, I was participating regularly and I never won. So this kind of like stays in me and I still remember it to this day.